the measures and rules implemented by the UAE government to tackle the rising number of COVID-19 cases become more stringent and for good reason. Recently, government has had to shut down the entire private sector, airports are closed, malls, as well as open markets. A decision which is now impacting Nigerian food vendors in different ways. Located in the heart of the once busy financial district, Pan-African restaurant Kiza observes its last day of business until the health situation in the city of Dubai improves. Silence, empty chairs and tables now replace the liveliness that once attracted Nigerian tourists and residents seeking local dishes and entertainment. Most are now at home practicing social distancing. No, it's not about the business anymore. It's about our people internally and the general community as a whole. Um, if this virus is getting so um, so deadly in the way that it is spreading from communities to communities and from persons to persons. We just thought it right that for the safety of all our um, in-house employees and the general community as a whole um, to just shut down. 19 kilometers away in another part of town, Biggie's restaurant remains open with a few customers making bulk orders. <laughs> However, concerns are growing about the dwindling food stock. Half of what we are cooking here coming from Africa. So like, we don't have pepper, we don't have a lot of things that come from Africa now. We didn't get it easily because it's coming through airport. Many customers depend on restaurant services for their daily meals and hope the businesses keep running. We feel there should be some exceptions, especially in the food area, you know, so that people like us will be able to um, feed and uh, survive in this corona issue. Other Nigerian food vendors, such as this store, are also running out of supplies as buying patterns change. In next two or three weeks now, on highest one month, at least our stock will finish. So we are only playing to God to help us to calm the situation down. We're using this time to see how we can give our customers a better version of ourselves. So, um, you know, we're just trying to take some positives from this situation. Well, with Nigerian food vendors running out of supplies, Nigerians partial to local dishes may have to depend on foreign delicacies for sustenance. From Dubai in the United Arab Emirates, Maya Wadigoke for Channels Television News.